so this was just like a really quick snapshot of some gorgeous dancing. Um, I thought this dancer was so talented. She was graceful and agile and moved so beautifully. It was especially nice to watch her out of the studio and um, with the city in the background. It was such a nice contrast between the two things. The first thing, the performer in it was so captivating. She has this amazing relationship with the camera. Uh, she looks like she's having so much fun dancing. And I also really like the uh, idea of taking a ballet dancer and showing the juxtaposition between them performing in a studio in traditional ballet wear and then taking them outside into the real world, putting her in casual clothing and then having her perform a very similar dance and sort of bookending it with these uh, performances in the studio. Um, it breathed a lot of life into what could have been a very um, static film. Uh, the use of color and the way that, again, she played off the camera just gave it so much more joy, um, which was very pleasant to watch. And she's a beautiful dancer. So this is a very beautiful, very elegant piece. I just love how we're being transported between two worlds here. Uh, we start off and we end up in this kind in, in a classical sphere, you know, she's in a in this nondescript white room It's almost a spiritual or a other dimension, but it's it's it has a very a sense of classical uh, About it, you know, and, and she's in a more traditional uh, garb and uh, you know doing a, a more balletic style Classical style and then you know, we're, we're, we're out on the street She comes up from the subway and uh, we're out on the street and doing a, a, a you know a hybrid style you know against this urban backdrop and then going back so it's almost like she's having a dream of another place but which place is real which place is the dream so i really enjoyed that um wonderful directing editing the photography was beautiful the costuming was great makeup was great um the lead actress that the performer on screen just did such an elegant beautiful job she just was just absolutely wonderful such uh, grace and style and expression. Very beautiful dancer, great job there. So um, great job with this. Um, I can see that it was a very small team and that's wonderful that just a few folks were able to get, get together and make beautiful art like this. So thank you for making this and please keep making more. And I hope this one gets out and gets seen because it was just it was just really wonderful. Happened was a really beautiful short dance piece. Um, I think you got the the cleanliness of the lines and and just um, having the ballet shown um, in simplicity and then putting it out, um, you know, in like Astor Place in New York. Like it, it was very nice to see those two contrast um, kind of showing the the life of ballet um, specifically in New York City, you know, um, really contained within um the walls of like a dance studio and then you go out and you don't know who on the street is passing you and also a dancer but a very beautiful piece and i really enjoyed watching it i think the film happened did a great job presenting a contrast between classical ballet and the way that a dancer would dress in that traditional studio setting with the outdoor setting of more street style clothing and interpretive modern style of movement. I think the camera work reflected that as well. The camera towards the beginning seemed to be slightly more stationary and controlled, whereas outside the camera work, I think there was a lot more movement and the movement was more sweeping and I think that was fitting for the choreography there. As I was watching the film, I was thinking perhaps the way the dancer looks so free in this outdoor space is how she feels while she's dancing classical ballet as well. Um, but I also thought it was interesting to show the difference because it speaks to the range that we all have as artists. Deja Vu is for Happens. This, I, I also liked the contrast with this beautiful pink costume in a contained setting with studio lights and just enjoying the music and giving all the talent with the ballet dancing. Then we move 
from this romantic piano music with the chaos in the city on, in an urban scenery with a complete change of clothing that's quite dynamic and it just fully encircles what dancing might be for this character and it is a perfect closing as well.